Hi, this is Jake. This is another video in a series that I'm doing to improve your Windows security. Today I'm going to show you how to set the screensaver to kick on on your computer, your Windows 10 computer, and, how, and have it lock out the user and require a password in order to get back in. So you're probably going to want to do this uh, because you know when you're in the course of the day when you're doing some work you may have your email open or you may have uh, some bank account information and you may be at work or at home and you may not necessarily, not necessarily want somebody to see what you're working on or you know, maybe even access your data. Um, you know, uh, one of the uh, or you don't want a practical joker getting on your Facebook and posting something embarrassing to your um, Facebook uh, feed. So let me, uh, let's go over to my Windows 10 computer and show you how to do that. Okay, so this is a uh, Windows 10, there it was. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so let me log on to Windows 10. Okay, so to get to the screensaver settings, um, the easiest way to do it uh, for me is just to get to the desktop, right click, and go to personalize. All right, once the, the personalized uh, screen comes up, the settings, I want to go to lock screen, and I want to scroll down to screensaver settings. And here I have, uh, I first, first step is to select a screensaver. I'm going to go ahead and select uh, Mystify. And this is the duration required for the screensaver to kick on. And I'm going to change that to about five minutes. I like five minutes is a good time for me. But you can set that to whatever you're comfortable, five minutes, ten minutes, you know, something like that. So it's the amount of time that you uh, want the to the computer to be idle before it kicks into screensaver mode and locks out any users. So if you have it too short, it'll be kicking on all the time while you're sitting at your desk, uh, you know, doing work and you know, you're not necessarily stepping away, but you're just doing, maybe you're doing something else or maybe you got on the phone to uh, pick, make a phone call. You don't want your screensaver kicking on and you having to log in every time. So you may want to adjust that um, setting accordingly. So the other thing is you have to click this um, this checkbox on resume display login screen and that's going to give you the password prompt. And that's about it. All you have to do is just close your screens and wait and it'll uh, kick on as uh, you'll see. Now the other way to do it uh, is to go to settings by clicking on the start button and you can select settings and the easiest way I've, I've found to um, find the screensaver is to go to find a setting and just type in screensaver. And it will search your settings for uh, screensaver and I have changed screensaver so I'll click on that. And there you go, I'm in the same exact spot. So that's about it. So in five minutes of inactivity, the computer will uh, switch over to um, screensaver and when sh someone tries to get back on the computer it's going to require a password. It's that easy. It's a very basic thing to do. Uh, I think it's very smart and you know, uh, just one more thing to improve your Windows security. So thank you for watching and please subscribe to my YouTube channel and leave comments below. Thank you very much.